We're starting our day in the car wash. The Magic Wash is a uh, local wash here in Fond du Lac. So we're just uh, getting the day started with a little, little wash. Uh, my name is Eric. I am currently a Uber driver. Uh, soon to be filmmaker. I'm currently in the process of learning everything I can about being a filmmaker. So this is a little, a little video about how I became and how I decided to become a filmmaker and what really inspired that journey along the way. Uh, so you come with me today. We're gonna, we're gonna live the life of the Uber driver, but we're going to talk about everything and my inspiration. So. All right, so we're currently driving. Uh, we're driving to the location of my first official video. Now, this was before the days of YouTube. Um, this was this was where I grew up, or one of the houses I grew up in. Uh, we moved when I was in high school. So in high school, I took a course in. Uh, gosh, I wanted to say it was like it was called like films or something like that. It was a short film class, and we created a couple different things. Um, I don't know if I still have the footage, but we're gonna pull up right here. This is the house. You can see back there, that's where the video was shot. And I'll, I'll give you a little brief explanation. All right, so we're outside the, the house where I filmed my first video. It was a short video where I more or less, it was a serial killer murder story. Um, shot in first person uh, with a mini DV camera. My friend drove an old Camaro and he was a serial killer uh, coming to get me and my girlfriend at the time. Now, the funny part about this was we just dug through my garage and found various things that could be weapons. Um, so the weapon that was his choice, I'm gonna find this footage, I will. I have I have uh, several mini DVs, it's probably on there, uh, along with my high school news. But the funny part of this was, we used a crowbar, and that crowbar was passed down. Now, one of my relatives was supposedly in the mafia. So it quite possibly could have been used to beat somebody up or kill someone. We don't know. But the funny part is it's the first person he kills me or he kills my girlfriend and then he kills me down by that creek back there. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, but there's back in the woods there, there's a creek. Um, and it was just it was a funny, funny story. Um my teacher loved it, thought it was hilarious, even though it was a high school project. So, yeah, that was my first movie. That was my first real movie. I am gonna find it, I'm gonna put it on YouTube at some point. Um, I don't know a whole lot about converting DV to, to digital, but that's gonna be awesome, once I get it. So I'll have to Google that, YouTube it, whatever, figure out how to do it, find something that can convert it. I almost think I have that camera. I might still have that camera, so we'll see what I can do. But yeah, that was my first movie.
All right, so this is the old drive into work. This is this is location number two of my film career. Good old Johnson Street. So I had about a five to ten minute ride, depending on the lights. As you can see, we're passing quite a few of them. Um, one of the things that happened here was this is where I discovered Casey Neistat videos and vlogs and YouTube, and that's really the the catalyst to what me, got me started on the internet with online video. I mentioned previously that I had already recorded a video and had a film class and um, high school level was very interested in it, but didn't didn't see it as a viable job. So this this was my job that we're going to. I was an automotive salesperson. Uh, for the better part of 10 years, it was a very good career, but at the same time, it was not what I wanted to do. I could tell the long haul of it for me was just not something that was the daily. It wasn't the everyday. I couldn't just do it. So we're going to go drive into this lot here, and uh, hopefully we won't get harassed by my old coworkers. So we're gonna make a quick. Now, I'm gonna just state for the record that this sign, this building, is new since I left. So, so th some of my very first YouTube. So that is the dealership that I worked for. Uh, some of my very first YouTube content came out of that dealership. Um, I had a lot of a lot of time uh, during my day where I was able to record and think of ideas for content. So I wrote a lot of my first YouTube content. Um, I had a job at that dealership, the dealership, where I was the video creator. So I created three to four minute videos where I walked around the car talking about all the features of the car for the website. I was in charge of posting them to the website. It was a pretty cool gig, but it was a demotion at the time, so like it wasn't the best deal, you know? And I also created a YouTube channel which I got slammed for and uh, made to take it down. <laughs> wasn't one of my brighter moments.